Hi there, everyone. My name is Paddy Russell, and I'm the head teacher here at Ladybridge. And this video and document is all about consultation that we want to have with our local community about the footpath that runs through the school site. So as I'm sure you know, if, you, if you're watching this, uh, we've got a footpath that runs from uh, Wigan Road to the school and to the, to the Lady Bridge estate. And we wish to retain that path because uh, it's a really valuable route for the community. It's, it's a really useful shortcut, but we wish to move it to safeguard our learners and to improve the security of the school site. So we're proposing to move it to the perimeter of the field. I'll show you exactly where um, in a moment and to install um, an eight foot palisade fence to separate the path from the school fields. So let me, let me talk you through why we wish to do this. So the arrangement that we've got at the moment is unsafe. Having a footpath going right the way through the school site we believe is unsafe. Antisocial behaviour has been reported by, by local residents that isn't linked to our, to our school community. And concerns that we have around safety prevent us from using a large proportion of the school site. Um, it's quite rare, actually, that we use quite, you know, certain parts of the school um, site that we use very, very rarely. And if we move the path, it will open up all sorts of interesting learning opportunities for our for our young people in those areas of the of the school site. Um, as you will know as well, uh, the community use our site extensively, the swimming pool, leisure centre and the 3G pitches that we have. And moving the path, the installation of a new fence will create a safer and less exposed environment for all of the people who come to use the school site. So where are we proposing to move it? Well, as I said before, it's the perimeter of the field. And wanna get your views on this. So what I'm describing to you and showing you now is not definite, this is genuine consultation. So the black line there is where the path is at the moment. So as you can see right the way through the site and we're proposing to have um, a new path, which is the blue line there and the red line is the fence. And you can see it even better on here. So I'll make that slightly larger, uh, where you can see that's the 3G. These are the, this is the school field. This area there I'm gonna talk about a bit, which is the Healy Triangle area. And again, we're, we're proposing um, to move the path from the black line where it is, where it's indicated there to the light blue line. Um, and the fence I refer to looks like that. So it's a classic palisade fence to improve security. So are there alternatives to the plan? Yes, there very much are. This is a starting point. This is genuine consultation, as I said before. So um, we want to look at, well, we want to firstly see what you think about these plans but also we want to engage with the community to find out about what other ideas you may have about um, for ways in which the local com community can use our site and work positively and safely with our young people. Now, we're very aware that the local community has lost some green spaces over recent years. And in addition to that, I'm, I'm sure many will know there's plans that are uh, in their infancy to build a new school on Haslam Park. So I'm, I'm fully aware that there may be some concerns there about um, that are we losing another green space here? So we're keen to work really closely with the community to look at ways in which we can maintain community use of our site. And in fact, enhance and increase community use of our site whilst making it safer for our learners. So firstly, the position of the new fence is, is just one option. The position that I've described is one option. You might have some other ideas that might enable certain areas of the site to continue to be used um, to exercise dogs, for example. Uh, we're also looking to develop a wildflower meadow, which would be, let me just go back to the pictures, which will be around here, where I'm indicating there, so this area here and potentially up there. 
And what we what we could do is look at uh, potential community use of that area during specific times it's not being used by the school. Um, I mentioned the Dealey Triangle area, um, and I'm wondering what we could do together with that space. So the Dealey Triangle area is quite a large area here. Uh, so it's the bit that's at the top right of the diagram here. So it's that space there. And we're wondering how that area could be developed working with the local community and to have open access to that area to the local community. Perhaps we could have community allotments there. Uh, we've already obviously got allotments around here. So perhaps there could be allotments here that are joint school and community allotments. It's just one idea, one suggestion. So we're really keen to get your ideas and this consultation is going to run to the 22nd of December, so the end of the school term. You can click on the link in the document to go to an office form, or you can actually complete the form within the document itself, which is here. And um, yeah, that's it. And then I will get in touch with, with, um, with the community in the spring once we've got the results of the consultation. And I'm more than happy to walk out the site with, with local uh, local residents and discuss directly what we could potentially do together oh just be aware that date has changed it's the 22nd of december it's changed now on the forms all right thanks very much then everyone thank you